Hey guys, thanks for watching, uh, joining me on this video. Uh, I'm making this video in response to uh, an incident that happened this morning. Um, I posted it uh, pertaining, uh, I believe it's titled, Filthy Scumbag Cop Tries to Intimidate Me. Um, this is the reason I'm posting it. Uh, what that police officer was trying to do was uh, trying to shame me or uh, trying to smear my reputation here in town. Um, keep in mind, I've never, I haven't been involved in any criminal activity here in town. I don't uh, break the law. I don't uh, cause trouble and quite the opposite. Uh, I try to do as much good for the community as I can here in town. And I, uh, I have a lot of people uh, that would attest to that. Um, basically, what he was trying to do was to try to smear my reputation because uh, um, I hold police accountable and uh, and I don't hide my disdain for uh, uh, the gangster culture that uh, they represent um, and the way they treat the citizens. Keep in mind, I did not start this YouTube channel with the sole intention of, uh, of filming police. Um, it was just a vlog channel. I simply was doing a vlog, a vlog channel. As you can see, chronologically, if you look at my channel, um, it was uh, six months into my YouTube channel uh, uh, until my first, uh, until Adam Eckert uh, and the uh, uh, police um, got involved with uh, with me when I was filming from my own property 60 feet away. That would be the uh, You Engaged Me Jackass video. Uh, maybe check that one out. That's when all this all started. Um, when I was filming from 60 feet away uh, from my own property, a police encounter, uh, and a police officer came over and tried to illegally ID me and tried to illegally tell me to stop filming. Um, and when I wouldn't want, when I didn't, when I refused, um, he went back and uh, Adam Eckert, the uh, chief fire scum, he came over and took my picture illegally. Uh, well, not even illegally. He's well entitled to take my picture. But what it represented was an attempt to intimidate me and or to ID me because I wouldn't ID to the cop. Uh, the, the cop tried to illegally ID me uh, with no crime committed and uh, nothing to back it up and I refused to ID. I told them to cram rocks or something. And uh, basically uh, after that, he, uh, the Adam Eckert, the fire scum, he come over and uh, he took my picture uh, in, in A to use uh, for clear view to ID me um, or B to try to intimidate me, um, which shows you just how the scummy the police and fire department are here in Welland. Disgusting animals, all of them vermin. One of these filthy, uh, dirty fire scum um, actually uh, wished me and a friend dead. Check that video out too. Uh, uh, they're disgusting animals here. I've got tons of testimony of uh, just how incourteous and discourteous uh, they treat the citizens here in town. Um, absolute animals. Uh, yeah, they're they're just vermin. Anyway, uh, so he's trying to was trying to uh, smear my um, uh, smear my name and reputation, which uh, he can't do. It's I, my life is an open book. Um, like I say, it, it was only once I started filming the police and started filming, uh, recording uh, them is that is that they uh, uh, escalated. And as you can just watch my channel chronologically, uh, even the uh, police cop watch playlists and you can see uh, the progression of their disgustingness. Um, OK, so this is uh, this last video was the latest culmination of their tactics. And what they're referring to is uh, radius warrants that I've had. Uh, they're over almost over 20 years old now. Um, from when I was a kid, well, not even a kid, a young man, um, when I was drinking uh, substance abuse and whatnot, and I, I was a scumbag. Uh, however, I grew up. I learned how to become a uh, citizen that other people would look up to. I learned how to become a citizen uh, that others inspire, uh, that I inspire uh, uh, good behavior and good actions in others. And um, I became a person that treats others the way they want to be treated. And uh, everybody in town that knows me knows that this is the kind of person I am. So that's why I'm not worried about the filthy, disgusting swine uh, trying to smear my uh, 
my reputation here in town. Um, but what they've done is they've driven me to, uh, I'm going to get a copy of my uh, criminal record. Uh, if you notice that that was the worst thing he could possibly come out with out of my entire record, and that was the worst thing he could come up with. So it gives you an idea of how, uh, how what kind of, uh, even as a scumbag, I knew there were limits. I knew there were lines you don't cross. I knew you don't do sexual crimes. I know you don't do uh, uh, anything, you know. Uh, uh, it's basically, I, I stole shit. I was a thief. I was a, a, a I, I property crimes and uh, and drinking and and getting into trouble while drinking. But anyway, I'm gonna post. Uh, I'm gonna make a video upcoming as soon as I can. Um, that ha that basically puts lays my my record out there as an open book. Uh, anyone can actually go down to the police and ask for a, a records check of me. And uh, I think you even have to pay 20 bucks or something. But I'm going to make a video about it just to explain and show people what uh, what my uh, what I did in my uh, youth and how, what what has led me to uh, change and be a better person and want to become a better person. So uh, Anyway, that's what they've done. Um, I Like I say, my life is an open book. I have nothing to be ashamed of in my life. Uh, yes, I made uh, mistakes. Yes, I've done things in my life that uh, now, of course, I would never consider doing. Um, and the only reason that the police are targeting me now and trying to act like idiots and uh, is because their actions have catapulted my channel into over 1,000 subscribers and almost 300,000 views. Before this, six months into my vlogging channel, I had 50 subscribers. 50 subscribers and uh, less than 3,000 views. And now I'm averaging 3,000 views a month. And it's only getting going up, up, up because of the actions of the uh, 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 filthy scumbags at the NRP. And uh, like the actions of this officer that uh, that uh, was in the featured in this video. Um Disgusting animals, I, I imagine. I wish more police would shoot each other. Uh, I, I wish more NRP officers would uh, would shoot their colleagues and uh, get into gunfights with each other at the side of the road. I wish that would happen a lot more because a lot more of those filthy, tyrannical swine need to die. And uh, I personally, um, I am so happy when I hear of dead cops because I know a dead tyrant, it means safer citizens. A dead tyrant means that no, no citizens are being terrorized by that particular tyrant again and uh, NRP is rife with tyrants uh, basically the, I think the Canada Solicitor General needs to come down and have a look at how uh, the NRP is being run they only need to have a look at my channel and check it out chronologically to see how the uh, NRP treat a man who has done nothing illegal nothing wrong since I've lived here nothing wrong nothing illegal no charges no nothing and this is I've got over a hundred videos uh, uh, some of them of, of showing incredible, incredible swinish, disgusting, tyrannical behavior uh, from these people uh, in uniform. And this is how they treat a guy who's done nothing wrong, nothing illegal. And this is how they treat a guy. Imagine how they treat people when there's no cameras running. If they're willing to treat a person that has a platform, a media platform, and uh, uh, treat uh, someone that actually has a forum that they can get and uh, get out, show show the public how disgusting and how 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 verminous they act and they still treat you me like that when they uh when 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 they're faced with with a growing subscriber list they don't care they don't care how that makes them look and that's why i think the solicitor general should uh, open an inquiry into just uh, uh how the nrp gets to a stage like this how the NRP gets to a stage where two of its officers can 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 literally get into a gunfight with each other, and two years after uh, uh, investigating themselves, uh, they can find that they did nothing wrong, and that uh, uh, these guys need victim services and counseling and blah blah blah. Fuck, disgusting animals. Um, disgusting. They need to be investigated. There needs to be people fired. Uh, there needs to be change in leadership that lets these kind of animals run around the street and act like this. Uh, definitely. Disgusting animals. Thanks for watching. Uh, look out for that. Watch out for that video. Stay tuned for that video coming up showing my record. Uh, I'm not proud of it, but uh, uh, police are trying to smear my reputation and I have nothing to hide.
I have nothing to hide. I've lived in this town for almost 13, 14 years now, and uh, I've done nothing but good for this community. And turns out I'm actually pretty good at highlighting police corruption and police disgusting uh, uh, behavior, and I'll continue to do that. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next one.